welcome back to my channel. It's me, your girl, Leah. And we are back with another monthly favorite video. I'm so happy to be in my new home. As you can see, there's a very, very big difference in the background setting of my videos now and moving forward, there will be. So go ahead, sit back, sit tight, grab a drink and a snack. Happy Thanksgiving, happy holidays to everybody and I hope you enjoy this video. So first I want to brag about this dossier dupe, Amber Saffron. This is a dupe of the Baccarat Rouge 540 Mason Francis Kirkjohn and it smells so good. Now I do not own the original, the true authentic version of this dupe, but it smells so good. If you want to smell amazing or even gift an amazing gift this holiday season, definitely check out Dossier, a endless list of dupe perfumes from our very, very popular brands that are out there on the market. They also include this really informational card that tells you all the top, middle, and bottom notes of the perfumes. It tells you what the percent is, what the inspired perfume is, and basically their mission statement. I am going to go ahead and spray some on me at the, why not right now while we are on camera? Oh my goodness, ah, it smells so good. Now this is more so of a male's perfume or cologne, but you guys, this perfume smells so good. You have a preference and you're confident in what you put on you can rock anything the sky is the limit honestly so i definitely definitely want you to check out dossier all of the information is going to be linked down below in the description and i also have a discount code for you to use on your purchase so you can save the next product i want to brag about this winter that you definitely need to make sure is in your skincare overall body care wellness self care routine is some spf this product is coming from dermatology this is their tinted spf 46 now this spf is so amazing because it is flawlessly rubbed in into any skin tone now when we hear about tinted spfs a lot of time we're like oh my goodness what hue is it what tone is it is it going to sit on the highest fitzpatrick or darker skin tone to the very very lowest fitzpatrick even on the most lighter tone skin so let's see right here right now while we are all here i'm going to squirt that up there and rub it in this is going to be real time i am not going to speed this up chop this up do any of that because I want y'all to really truly see how flawlessly this SPF rubs in and it gives such a beautiful dewy glow that I think all of us really really like for our skin to look. It just looks overall so healthy and look at that. I mean there's a little bit of lotion on this hand but look at it with this SPF on this side like it has almost like a scentless smell it does have some type of scent like you know a product does smell like something but it doesn't have a fragrance at all this is a universal tinted moisturizer spf of 46 it is uva and uvb broad spectrum protection this is going to help you glow and protect your skin it has that 12 percent of zinc oxide and 7.5 percent octane oxate in the spf too so you guys i really want y'all to check this out this is going to be in my amazon store and as you can click right into the category of spf it's not even in my skincare it's not in my salon skincare it just has its own category of spf click on it and those are all of my favorite products you know that contain sunscreen moving on this is going to stay into the skincare skin hydration protection recovery um helping hyperpigmentation all that and a little bit of exfoliation and then i'm going to move into a concealer that i really really think you should consider trying out if you haven't okay so this is going to be into the sunday riley skincare line now you guys i have heard about this line i have heard about this line and i have heard even more about this line but you know me being my stubborn self i was like oh my gosh i don't want to like you know go out and spend a whole bunch of money just because this person and this person and this person and that person are saying like you should try this out so you guys sunday riley 
did send me some products and I used them. And you guys, they did not disappoint. I did do an Instagram reel, I think, and a TikTok talking about the products and my skincare routine. Now this is like, I would say almost a month into uh, after that video, but I've definitely been using these products for a full month. Oh my goodness, the amount of healthy overall skin I have been able to view on myself like, what? My skin feels and looks so much more healthy than what it was before I was using it. And it's not to say that it was like just in some poor condition, it wasn't. But because of these products, my skin looks like so much better. So this was the um, product that I was using. This is actually empty now, so, but I did keep the bottle for the video. This is the CEO 15% Vitamin C uh, Brightening Serum. And oh my gosh, it does come in this little bitty, bitty baby size. It also comes in a much larger size, so definitely check that out. But if you are like, okay, let me take this slow, let me try this out, and then, you know, if it works and I see a great improvement, let me, you know, take that initiation into purchasing and investing more into the larger size. This is also going to be in my Amazon store, but this is going to be in my skincare. I also want to talk about the Good Genes All-in-One Lactic Acid Treatment. Now, I have probably like five to seven more pumps and squeezes out of this one because I love it so much. At first, I was like, okay, let me just try, like, you know what I'm saying, be positive and just go for it, trying these products out, not really thinking like, okay, I'm going to see this huge improvement in my overall skin health and, you know, nothing, nothing like that. I love this exfoliator. It is so gentle. I think this is great for everyone. Now, if you do have any type of sensitivities to dairy or milk, you may want to steer clear of the lactic. Um, if you have experienced some issues with putting lactic products, lactic acid products on your skin topically. Now, some people do have an allergic reaction to more so like dairy products internally, but not surface topically. So make sure you try this out, like going slowly. Don't just jump right into this product um, and you know, take it slow. And you should definitely think about doing or incorporating all products that way that may be new to you and or exfoliants. I love now lastly, this is what I have the most of and it's not because I don't use it. It's just because it's bigger. So um, I want to say it is bigger. Yes, yeah, much bigger. So this is the CEO Afterglow Brightening Vitamin C Cream also by Sunday Riley. Of course, this is so like, ooh, it's like almost, I don't know if y'all see this as like a lemony orangey, but this is definitely like an orangey color. like. It kind of does look yellow. I'm not going to lie. It kind of does. But that's not why we're here. We're here because the product really, truly works. And my skin feels so buttery, not heavy, but I don't know. It just feels so very moisturized, so fed. Like I gave all of the correct ingredients to my skin. This is exactly what my skin was asking for and so much more that it didn't even know that it needed. So I highly recommend this line y'all. Like I was very, very pleasantly surprised with this line um, with correcting hyperpigmentation with overall health and glow of my skin. Um, the hyperpigmentation is fading so beautifully with in combination with wearing SPF. So let's not forget that main, main, main product that needs to be applied in the daytime after you moisturize. Now, lastly, I would like to talk about this cosmetic makeup product. This is Hourglass, you guys. This is the Hourglass. I actually think this is a foundation stick and or if it is a concealer, it works, it can work as both, depending on what shade you purchase. So, I just love this stick. And y'all, I've had this, this, this product for a while, and I'm like, how have I never shared this product with all of my beautiful audience? So, not only does it have like really good weight to the actual packaging, but the product goes on so buttery smooth and I actually manipulate my concealer foundation, I guess, or foundation stick in with a brush. I feel like when I use a um, 
sponge i feel like that works better with liquid foundation and a brush works better with like a stick foundation because it doesn't remove so much of it i feel like the sponge picks up a lot of products and it removes it and then you're like oh my god okay let me put a little bit more on yeah so if y'all have not tried this the color that i have is golden amber and i think this is more so my color perfect in the summertime versus the winter time so make sure you get a tone that can be used as a concealer in i guess the summertime and then a foundation in the winter time if that makes sense i think i said that backwards I might say that backwards, but y'all get what I'm saying. So these are my top five products. Now I know this is a little bit more than five because we had the perfume from Dossier, we had the SPF, we had the two serums, the moisturizer, and the concealer. But all in all, these are my top products at the moment. I have been wearing a little bit more makeup. It's still very neutral, very natural. I don't have any lashes on, but I am wearing makeup a little bit more to like get in the groove, you know, get in the groove of creating content and looking very, I feel like done up in a sense for me at least. So I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I hope y'all having a great Thanksgiving shopping and doing fun things with family and friends during this time of the year. So if y'all enjoyed it, please thumbs up this video. Check out all of the products that I have shared. The dossier is gonna be linked down below and all the products that are gonna be in my Amazon store. And I'm gonna try to find that hourglass foundation um, or concealer stick in Amazon. And if it is there, perfect. If not, you can go over to Sephora and pick it up because that's where I purchased mine from. So I love y'all so much and I will see y'all next time. Bye guys, happy holidays.